hey guys welcome to a new vlog this is going to be a unique vlog actually i'm going to be taking you guys to my school so that you see how my school looks like and the kinds of things that we have basically just to show you around warsaw university of technology which is my school or did i mention i'm also a student ambassador part of the things that i do as a student ambassador is you know responding to queries from students who intend to study at my school things that include tuition the kinds of studies that we do masters and bachelor's programs and then basically life in campus and this is sort of a life in campus vlog so you get to see that um i'll probably show you my own department and maybe some other things not everything but you get the gist so come with me to my uni and i hope you like it everything goes white i can feel the breeze euphoric delight This is where you can get all the information happening about school, use, useful addresses. If you're a new student, this is everything you need. You know, this is all the courses that is offered here in this school. Um, in a separate video, I'm going to talk about all of this. Yeah, that's my course, the Department of Chemistry. So you can see we have data science, management and production, engineering photonics, mechatronics, power engineering, robotics, aerospace engineering. These are all master science courses. And this is also bachelor's courses. You can see we have architecture, we have um, civil engineering, environmental engineering, computer science, mechatronics, power engineering. These are all courses that are in English. These ones here are in Polish. These are Polish courses. So um for intern this is not for international students so nope not this ones and these are useful addresses and these um we have language courses so we have courses in english language we also have polish language courses and these these are the dormitories that are in these are all the dormitories that we have in at the Warsaw University of Technology. We have Academic, we have Babylon, we have Bratniak, we have Riveria, we have Rineska Tulipan, we have Mikrus, Tatraska, Utro, Nisia, and Zajek. I'm not sure if I pronounced that well. But these are all places where students live. And here's another board where you can also find a lot of information these places are really important guys if you need any information about you know anything that concerns opportunities for students these are the places that you come to check honestly all the informations are here you may not find them online but you'll find them on this board so do well to check out this board if you come to the library or you come to school you can just walk through here and check out and see if there's anything that you can find especially during summer there are a lot of opportunities that are posted on this board so do check this board this is the international students office so this is where it is room 233 if you have any issues you can always come here so this is this is the hall you guys you can see this is the place where a lot of conferences or recruitment fairs goes on Warsaw University of Technology in collaboration with companies in Warsaw usually organize recruitment fairs where they come and you know recruit from directly from campuses and this is where it usually happens in this very big hall I'm walking towards the chemical department and I'm hoping that it's still open because I just noticed that everywhere is closed um, well this is the area around my school 
so you can see from here that we have some shops where we usually buy coffee or buy snacks during class this is just a side of the school that's where i'm coming from where the main building is at the back of the main building is where you would find the the departments um so my department is actually at the back of this building and i'm hoping that it's still open so that i can take you guys there that's also japka that's where we also get some things i'm actually really running out of space this is one challenge i face as a content creator because each time i run out of space i run out of space all the time this is the chemistry faculty um, you can see this is you can see from this windows this is our labs some of the labs i'm not sure there's anyone there now um and this you can see it's written uh, i don't know how to pronounce that but this is kemi <laughs> and that is sorry you guys this is really dark <laughs> it's very dark because i mean i'm making this video tonight so please stay with me uh this is where our uh, security people usually are and normally nobody would be here but sometimes we usually have classes especially during the winter and it used to get dark <laughs> where we have those classes <clears throat> this is a common area this is the common area where we we stay for where we wait for anything and this is where we get snacks so this is also a common area but we usually get snacks from that vending machine there this vending machine used to be my lifesaver because i was always getting stuff here <laughs> i always got this is veggies i always got from here so this is our vending machine and this is where we get the coffee if you if you need coffee you can get coffee from here but the thing with this coffee machine is that it's always in polish i'm back from school i wanted to find something to eat because i'm really famished you guys although i took food to school i usually take like packed food with me to school it's um easier for me that way but i want to go to someone's place i want to make her hair because she's getting married tomorrow right now i'm famished let me look for food then i'll head over to the person's place hey guys good morning so this is the next day and i remember i told you guys i was going to make someone's hair guys i'm just coming back i'm telling you i just i'm just coming back and i'm so exhausted because the hair was supposed to be from i think um, 8 p.m because you know she had to do some running around and also it was convenient for me because i had to go to the library and all we started the hair by nine because for some weird reason i ran out of internet and then i had to sort of navigate my way to the place when i eventually got there they already had the bridal shower it was sort of a girl's night out this was one of those girls night out that you go to and you learn so much there was so much um fun so much you know education um especially you know around girl thing honestly i actually want to have this kind of you know girls night out thing where you have like real conversations you know talking about real things not just talking about surface stuff but like talking about real things these girls 
they had it down and she's really lucky to have the kinds of friends that surround her because they they were giving advices you know you know everyone was sharing experiences i went there to style the hair but i learned a lot and it was really nice for me I finally got the fields at nightfall for myself I just wanted to try it out and then I got the other one the woman gold as gift I'm going home now I actually still need to get um, I need to get some things I'm, I'm running out of grocery I like to buy things in bulk when I buy things in bulk like monthly I like to buy it that way and then it stays that way till the end of the month. I don't have things to use in the house so I have to go and look for somewhere to buy. I need to go and find somewhere to buy. The problem now is that this is almost 10 p.m. Most of the shops I know will close around this time. The Bedrocker I know will close around this time. I think this will do. At this point I just want oil. I don't care what oil it is. just happened so i went to go and buy um coffee because i was rushing i couldn't do my coffee usually i do my coffee myself i usually um do my coffee myself and come with it to the library today i couldn't do it so because i was rushing and then i went to starbucks to go and buy coffee because usually when you come to the library, it's really quiet. That's why I'm whispering now. Sometimes you, you can be tempted to sleep off. That's how I went to go and buy coffee. <laughs> the cup they used to put the coffee for me was spilling coffee everywhere. The bag I was carrying, it was so heavy because I had my laptop, I had food. And then I went to buy water to, you know, to clean up the coffee mess. And then I went to also get this tissue 
let me just get this tissue at Jacka. Oh my god at some point i was getting upset by the way this coffee it was so expensive i think i got it for 16.99 swati i'm never trying to buy coffee again from starbucks i'm not doing it again whatever reason i did it before i'm not doing it again i am not this is the first time i'm getting it and this is the last time i'm getting it at least in a long while 